Oh hey fam, reporting to you live from the jacuzzi. Back at it again. No, really though, why do you guys watch me? So today we're gonna do something a little different. You know I like to keep things spicy, spice it up. We're gonna play a little game called Headlines with Ty from the jacuzzi, yay! But first, I want good fam. Thank you so much for watching my channel. If you're new here, hi, welcome, hello, sit down, relax, have some fun, oh yeah, and subscribe and like the video. Alright guys, I guess, I guess we're just gonna let that plane pass. It's all about you, whenever you're ready. Today we're gonna start with a story that, I don't know how I feel about it. A report came out, I'm pretty sure it's true, that Lonzo Ball and his girlfriend Denise Garcia are expecting their first child. Now, I'm not being judgmental, but here's the thing, they're so young, like are you serious? But, you know, as a woman, I'm allowed to say this, I think men do it too. I think for some reason women might do it a little bit more. This whole like locking someone down with a baby trend. It needs to stop. Again, not saying she did that. I'm just saying it needs to stop. Congratulations to both of them. Welcome baby big baller brand. Okay, Okay. my dog has gone AWOL and has wandered off. Miko! So he's still ignoring me. See, this is why I should never take him out of the house. Miko! Miko! Finally, he comes back looking like he's up to no good. I can see it in his eyes. Next, we're gonna talk about this whole Josh McDaniels thing. This is me shaking my head. Here's the thing. For those of you who don't know, Josh McDaniels is the Patriots offensive coach who got blessed out by Tom Brady earlier in the season. Remember this? You know what? I know he was open. I know it. I'm just Tom. I just, I just tell him. Okay, so he basically committed to being the Colts head coach. Next step in his career was probably tired of getting yelled at by Brady. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, us, the public, we think this is a done deal. Again, hoodwinked. Tuesday night, he announces and the Colts announce that not happening. He's decided to stay with the Patriots after having a little meeting with a you guessed it, Bill Belichick. Well, I wonder what Belichick said in that meeting. To be honest, guys, this is my thought. I'm not kidding. I think Belichick was probably like, yo, I'm out of here either now or next season, and I will groom you to be the Patriots head coach if you stay. That's my guess. Otherwise, if he was not given that guarantee, and I mean, when I say guarantee, I mean like paperwork signed, he just made one of the greatest and biggest asshole moves in sports history. It's tied with DeAndre Jordan swearing to the Mavs in like verbal agreement he's gonna sign with them and then getting what he wants from the Clippers and being like, I'm out. <laughs> kind of smart actually but the thing is guys your word is your honor you can't just go promising things and then taking them back I mean people do change their minds I just want to throw that out there in case I ever have to do it <laughs> let's move on so this next little bit is actually so sad I feel so so bad for Kristaps Porzingis he was just diagnosed with a torn ACL <laughs> That is not a good sign. That took out my man Kobe. Honestly, once your ACL tears, it's a mark of the end. Side for Zingas. But he goes down hard. Hope it's not for him. He's such a talented player, but it's not good. So you guys just gonna like fly the whole time I'm vlogging? All right guys, we're gonna do something we haven't done in a long time. We're gonna give out our daily Savage Awards. <laughs> Number one, it's gonna go to Russell Westbrook, Bryce Price. He's actually a regular on this list. In fact, I made this because of him. You live for challenges like tonight, four game losing streak, here you are on the road against arguably the best team in the NBA. How do you approach this game and how much do you look forward to it? What's my answer? You're probably good, yes. No, 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 what's my answer? How do I approach it? What's my answer? You play every game the same way. <laughs> I know you. <laughs> and our next, gonna have to go to Malcolm Jenkins, who uh, slapped Brady on the arse and mocked him after his failed catch attempt. <laughs> Well done. Our next actually goes to a high schooler. You gotta start them young. Good cry. So, committing to his future college football team. Tons of people watching. Posts are gonna be made on the internet. And my man does this. Well, that's one way.
way to become fan favorite. I okay, any other headlines we're talking about? There's LeBron James and the fact that he doesn't talk to the Cavs front office. We've known this. That's all. Folks, thanks for tuning in to another weekly, daily, monthly, I don't know, edition of uh, Headlines with Ty. Somewhere random. Much love, fam. <laughs> Hey fam, sorry to interrupt your regularly scheduled Thai programming. Uh, this is actually future Thai. Thing is past Thai in the koozie. She forgot to do her post notification shout out, so I'm here to do them. She could be a real bitch. We're shouting out El Dio, Rahim Hussein, Black Ops Rules 23, and Mellow. Hi. All right, I'll let you get back to past Thai.